Hello everyone and welcome back to the Keep Productive YouTube channel. Today we're talking about the brand new tables inside of Craft in their 1.7 update, which is a brand new version of their Mac and iOS application, and I'm sure they'll be bringing this to WebOS too. Essentially inside this version, you can create a table, you can do this through two different ways. You can slash, slash command table and create a simple table, let's say two by two. You can add a new um, column on the right by pressing this insert column. There is a keyboard shortcut for it and add new rows by pressing uh, command enter uh, if you want to. And you can do all the regular sort of stuff you would inside of a table like styling it. So for example, filling cell colors, etc. Etc. So it's all very easy to do. Um, and Craft have been doing a really good job recently, um, particularly in their new releases, because they've done this like daily note thing that we covered a few weeks ago. And it's really cool in the ability to actually create a note based on a meeting and be able to have that all synced inside of your Craft account. So as you can imagine, this 1.7 update is rolling out. I've already got the update, and that was just through the regular App Store uh, update through Mac. So it seems to be already out there in the wild. Um, you can also access it through this right-hand side, which has been slightly modified and upgraded. So you can see that you can drag text, tables, files, and also images from Unsplash in as well. Just slightly neater, slightly easier to access. Now, if you're interested in learning craft, we actually have a full course. And we're also um, doing a little bit more on Medium. If you want to check us out, um, we're doing some writing about productivity apps and the future of the market. So feel free to check us out there. Um, as I said, you can download all and get all those links in the description below. Anyway, folks, thank you very much and cheerio.